we got a we had a 1964 Ford Fairlane 500 plucked right out of southern Alabama. Three gentlemen trailered it up here. They traded this car in towards a Chevelle. And I'm telling you, this is a clean, dry body. Uh, he's made a lot of improvements. How about power rack and pinion steering? Power Wilwood four-wheel disc brakes? How about vintage air conditioning? This is just a car you get in and you just drive all afternoon. Why don't you join me and we'll go for a spin. Yeah, I was up on a trailer, so right out in the parking lot, I was able to get underneath the car. It's a clean, solid car. The hood, excellent, no issue at all. Lines up square, flush. All this is clean, clean metal. Nice, nice lines. I mean, that's dry and clean. Little cracking in the paint, right in the groove right there. Nice, clean door. Shuts like real nice. Uh, no bubbles, no pimples. It's not wavy, it's not rusty. The body looks great. The roof looks great. It's cold outside, it's got a little frost on it. Not frost, but uh, dew. Uh, clean trunk, straight, square. Lines up, no issues, no dents. I have not even seen a pimple. I have not even seen a, a little shopping cart ding all around the wheel wells, nice and clean. Again, square, flush, shuts like new, straight and clean. Got everything lines up nice. The body's just great on this car, it really is. Straight, dry, clean body. All of these gaps right on the money. Uh, repainted its original white color, just a smooth, glossy finish. I mean, I'm sure there's a little something here or there. I found them cracks I told you about, and that's very minor. Here's a chip, like on the inside edge, but it is polished, very smooth and glossy. It's a really nice paint job. So up front, Ford emblems are shiny. The grill looks like it's very good original. All that's nice and straight. Uh, Chrome bumpers probably new. These look new. He added a 289 high performance emblem. Side moldings are either new or they've been restored. They're like a nine out of 10. Windshield's new, it's crystal clear. The mirror is shiny. All this trim is very good original. I mean, it's an eight out of 10. It's straight, it's shiny. All of this looks really cool. Shiny, real nice. A little bit of pitting on this right here. Very minor. This looks real sharp. Uh, Rechromed uh, re bumper. And I'm sure all this anodized trim is original. It's not beat up. It's very respectable. A little bit of black paint is flaked off of it. Same thing on this side. Little freckles. This is looks new. The moldings all look new. You have a little bit of black paint peeled off right there. Put a tint on the glass. Glass is all in real nice shape. And it's sitting on some polished torque thrust wheels. It says Ford, Ford script right in the middle. I've never seen that before. Uh, they look like they're 15 inch, a little bit wider in the back maybe, or a little fatter tire. Uh, so it's really a, a nice clean exterior. Let's show you the interior. See how the trunk looks. Opens real nice. Uh, look at the nice, smooth, clean paint. The latch is clean. The sticker is real nice. Jam is real nice. Weather strip looks new. Very tidy and clean. Solid metal. Got a nice mat. Got a spare jack assembly. It's all bolted down the way it should be. This is just a good, clean, honest car. Matter of fact, I called the gentleman I bought it from just a few minutes ago just to go over a few things and he wanted to keep me on the phone he's very proud of this car he's telling me you just drive it anywhere jams are clean bottom of the door is clean weather strips look good door panels are nice and straight you know the armrests look good All the painted metal inside looks very nice Good, clean, honest, original dash area. This is probably original stuff. It's not beat up or broken. It's very nice. 
All the knobs match, the original radio, the chrome is sparkling. A nice clean glove box. Now it's got AC, so you, the vents are hidden down below here. Carpets are real nice as embroidered mats. FM converter, you can play FM music. The seats, I can tell you they're nice and firm. See how it's got this little bolster here in the cushion. Uh, correct upholstery in excellent shape. It has seat belts, which were optional. Looks like they're just in the front. You got floor mats and real nice carpet, the upholstery, the side panels, everything's excellent in the back, just like the front. I love the chrome piping and the chrome stitching. And then the rear shelf, all the trim, everywhere you look is very tidy. A white headliner is excellent. There's no holes or wrinkles. Dome light works. Visors look real good. Steering wheel looks nice and clean. It's Fair Lane 500. Look at the see-through shift indicator. It's very cool. Cruise-o-matic. Let's go take a look at the motor. That's the original 289. He said they resealed the motor, probably some gaskets in that. They did give it a new distributor and a new dual feed Holly carburetor with electric choke. So it's dressed up with the stickers and the chrome open element air cleaner. Just nice, smooth, clean metal all around the engine bay. Batteries properly secured. Upgraded aluminum radiator with an overflow and a big electric fan. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, vintage air conditioning. Well, it's modern air. I don't know if it's vintage air or what brand it is, but modern air, modern power steering. It looks like a new horn. Willwood power disc brakes. Just tidy and clean, so... Caleb's going to see, uh, show you how smooth it is on a test drive. Ford Fairlane. We're taking her around the block, showing you how she drives. It's a mostly original car, which you don't find every day. Uh, so it's pretty, pretty solid. Not gonna lie, everything seems very nice. I know it's been updated here and there, uh, but original drivetrain in it. But for uh, for a family sedan, she gets up in boogies feels pretty good over the bumps. I know the, the suspension was all replaced uh, and refreshing. The brakes feel really good. Steering's nice and tight on it. It's got power brakes. Yeah, they don't drag. They're not pulling left or right. This is a neat car. Turn signal lights up. Feels very smooth uh, clicking them through the gears. I'm sure it'll cancel. We'll try that and try the horn. It's not a hot rod, but you can cruise it and still have some pep in it. Horn works. Let's get her up to speed. Ooh, she sounds good, that's for sure. All right, this thing's not a dog. This has some pickup. We're doing 60, no problem, guys. Right over the bumps, nice and straight. I would be confident to take this on a road trip. Try the radio. Amazon. All right, so the original radio works. Speaker's nice and loud. I got the heat on. Uh, looks like there's a FM box underneath here, so you can switch it from AM to FM. Try the wipers. The wipers work. You have to. Oh no, they cancel themselves. Okay. Yeah, turn key. Seat's nice and comfy. I love a good bench seat. Yeah, this is a solid car. And it's got the right color combination. The blue with the white just looks really appealing. 
Man, this thing sounds amazing. Yeah, there you go. Get in and drive it. That's our motto. But 64 Fairlane, guys. So as I said earlier, underneath this car is just dry, clean, no rust, no repairs, not covered in tar or undercoat that people are hiding things with. Uh, all the suspension and steering was rebuilt. And as we were talking about, it does have a new rack and pinion power steering front end. Uh, it does have Willwood disc brakes at all four wheels, has a custom e-brake assembly, has a dual exhaust with Flowmasters. Um, you look up at the motor, it's nice and clean. The C4 automatic cruise matic transmission was resealed as well. Uh, gas tank was replaced, fuel lines, brake lines were replaced. So again, get in, drive this cross country. And while we were filming, we just hit 100,000 subscribers on our YouTube channel. So thank you for that. Keep subscribing, that way you can see the videos as they're posted. To find out more about this car, go to volocars.com, talk to the salesman. They'll help answer your questions about getting it delivered to your door, getting it financed. Thanks for watching.